Hey guys, today I'm going to be unboxing the Little Twin Stars Sweets Factory Remint and I received this set for Christmas so it was actually a little while ago but I'm just now getting around to opening it so let's check it out together. Here are the eight sets that are included. Usually these are in order so I'm going to start here and I'm going to work my way back. Here's a quick look at the packaging. It's always so cute and I love the Little Twin Stars. This is the basic pastry dough set. Here's the mixing bowl. There's a little star shape on the handle and, oh, you can lift it up like this, which means this can go in here. And there's a little Kiki and Lala. Nope, just one on the side here. So that sits there. And then here's a bag of flour and a little sift. And look at, there's a star on the bottom. The attention to detail is amazing. Here are some tiny pieces that I am very scared of losing, but they are little Kiki and Lala that supposedly sit on the edge of the bowl here. And that's the first set. Second box. Minna no dakko cookie. Chocolate hug cookies. Lots of little pieces again. Here's the cookie tray. It says little twin stars. It's so cute. Then here is the little chocolate jar. And these go in here. And then another piece that I'm definitely going to lose. A little lone star. I don't know why they did that. And the little lid. Here's a unicorn cookie. And I guess they're called um, chocolate hugs because Kiki and Lala are holding the little chocolates. And then there are cookie cutters to go with it. This is so perfect. I love it. Third box. Ooh, eclairs. Decorated eclair. Here are the contents. It looks like a baking tray with Kiki and Lala. And a decorated eclair. And a little bear to decorate it. Does he stand up? He does. Oops, maybe not. With a little piping bag. There. And here is a little cloud shaped dish and more cloud chocolates for decorating, maybe? And as a scooper. Fourth box. Classic lemon pie. It looks like a lemon meringue pie. Here is a pot with Kiki and Lala. Of course, they have it fully designed. And I think the lemon cream goes in here. Looks like this is a thermometer to measure the temperature of the lemon custard. A little bowl and I don't know what that's supposed to be. Sugar? And a lemon that fits right on top. And then here is the completed pie. We are now on to the fifth box. Glossy fruit tart plate. Here is a little jar of jam. Here it says napage, and this says napage or nappage, napage. <laughs> I'm not sure. So I'm assuming it's this, a type of, I am very lost. But here's the little pan, super cute. And then another little fellow to help out. Is this guy supposed to stand up on his own? Yes. Here's the tart. It's star-shaped with some whipped cream and a strawberry. And here are some cherries. The photo shows them sitting right here, so I don't know if this is a plate or a little prep board or what. Here is set six. Right? Yeah, six. Okay. Ooh. What is this? Developing new recipes. Oh, that's cute. Looks like there's a scale and a pastry of some sort, butter, I think that's butter, oh maybe it's pie crust, fresh cream, the sticker is a little crooked, a measuring cup, another little helper, a cat I think, he's the same color as the scale, there we go, seventh set,
Ooh. I feel like that's my reaction to every box. Uh, jelly with frosted cookie. Okay. And I think this goes in here. That's the jelly. And then here is the jelly dish. And is this the jelly that goes in here? And I think the cookie's supposed to lean on this. Here's a strainer, a wooden spoon with a little star cut out, and cider. We are now on the last one. Oh, there's the gum, which is not very good to be honest. Oh, this is a big set. Looks like a cake tray. Special anniversary cake. Cake stand. Cake. Mixing bowl. Cake frosting. Frosting tool. Whoops. Chocolate plate. And cake toppers. Uh, there are little dents on the cake. I think there's probably a certain way this goes. And a lid so it stays fresh. Oh, it fell over. Here's the full set all lined up. It is so pastel and I love it. I need a little miniature kitchen now to set all this up in. I hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for following along. Hopefully I'll have another remint set soon. And if you have any cute ones, send me pictures. I'm Studio Lorian on Instagram and Twitter, so I would love to see your photos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!